Buongiorno Torres, Jim Appel, Yorkshire Port, be having you done premiere impression video. Yes guys, <laughs> in case you can't tell, today's game comes all the way from France and it's made by Ichion and it's called Knights of Might. Now I have to say, I really like your title, Knights of Might. It sounds really cool and it's really nice to say, Knights of Might. Trippy and trippy and it must be said. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, guys, let's check out the older uh, options. What's this down here? Quitter, we're no quitter, we're not quitting, but we'll check out options. Okay, so I've got the old Torres Cores on, that's important. I, I, yeah, yeah, I want that on. And over here, as we can see, we've got the old Cecil Veneer de Lampshade de Curseur. Yes, I think I want to keep the lampshade on. Battle camera is on, awesome. Hopefully you guys can hear me. And what's, this is weird, what's this render distance? That's strange, render distance. I haven't really seen that in an RPG maybe. Uh, I'll tell you what, I'm gonna have a hundred, cause you know, why not? <laughs> and the shadow quality will have high. Uh, I think my laptop can take it, I'll see. I'll see if it starts lagging, I can turn it down. Uh, let's check out your credits then real quick. Oh yes, yes, mercy, mercy, D-O-V. Aquarius CJ Cree Pap Yonan Monior. Yes, yes. So, of course, right here we've got the old Cretisus, Decretisus, Desk Plugins, Utilitarians, Utensils, Remainder, Gradients. Yes. So, of course, we've got Jan Fly, Mog Hunter, Calv, Dan, Brian, Rocket Mancer, that's a cool name, I like that. RPG Maker, Cultivatius, Dread. Some random dude, aka some random dude. <laughs> and then down here, of course, we've got the old Atters, D Resources and Graphics. Q Mentus LS et Ixus Asi Des Applementus. Cool. And then, yeah, we've got stuff like Yan Fly Engines, we've got RPG Maker, Fez Resource Pack, we've got Katamuki Hibuki, we've got Hidden Ones MV Resource, and we've got Hidden Ones Resources Warehouse. So I've got two hidden ones, because he's very well hidden. <laughs> he likes to hide that one, you've got to put him twice. <laughs> and then down here, of course, we've got RPG Maker, best resource pack, and that is your audio. Cool, cool. So I like that, I'm liking your credits. Uh, I'm liking the title screen, I'm liking this girl here. She's got pink hair and we have a pink sword and a pink hand. So um, maybe this is us, maybe this is who we're playing as. Or maybe this is the villain. Maybe she's guarding this castle. So I'm liking this castle, this looks cool. It's kind of floating in the air, and you've got these birds, crows, or ravens. So yes, I'm really digging your art style. I really like this. I really like your menu screen, your, uh, your main title screen. It's very cool. And I really like your music as well. Tribian, Tribian. Yes, yes, Tribian. Okay, without further ado, let us non de déjà vu, as the French would say. Oh yes, I'm fluent, I am. <laughs> so what have we got here then? Voila la introduction. And we've got a choice. We've got OI or non-mercy. Um, so let's go for, let's go for OI. Let's do that one. <laughs> and don't worry guys, if you don't understand French, because your old friend Yorkshire Pud does, and he's going to translate it all for you. So what have we got here then exactly? Um, okay, so this here says, um, once upon a time, in a world far, far away, there were two crows that were flying high in the beautiful pink majestic sky. Their names were Bill and Ted. As they were flying, they saw something sinister. It was the Book of the Dead. And somebody was messing around with it and they summoned a great evil upon the land. And all the volcanoes from around the world started to erupt and exploded, spewing out volcanic ash, which covered the skies in a black soot for over a thousand years. But then it all calmed down, 
and uh, it was really, really nice afterwards. <laughs> the sun came out, the sky was blue, and everyone was really happy. Oh, uh, but, but then it got dark again, and everyone was really, really sad because it was night time. But then it turned out that it was just night time, and they woke up the following morning, and the sky was blue once more. The village rejoiced, and they, 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 they celebrated, and they went to the pub for a night. Oh, uh, but, but the, um, it got out of hand, and they had a big fight. Yes, the, the, the bar had a huge fight that spilled outside, and the entire city started to go into anarchy, and they started to smash everything up, and then it turned into a war, and then it turned into a world war, where hundreds of thousands of people started to die. There was rivers of blood and bone of the humanity. It was awful. But then, then, then it finished and everything went really nice. <laughs> there were blue skies once again, the grass was green, the children were playing in the fields, the birds were singing, and it was lovely. Oh, um, and then we had a drought. Yeah, yeah, global warming kicked in big time. And, um, yeah, this, this is where we are now, we're, we're in the desert. Mm. <laughs> so there you go, guys, that's the translation for you, that's what's happened. Somebody... Oh my god, what's this? This is a strange view. Oh wow, check this out, guys. Wow, I haven't really seen this on an RPG making game before. Oh wow. Uh, so this is your, um, I think this is what you called Mode 7 or Blast 7. I'm very bad with names. Uh, but yes, they use this on, uh, on F0 and on some levels of Contra. I'm sure I said that recently. <laughs> but yes, if you ever play F0 on the SNES, this is how they, this is how they do it. So yeah, it's, it's reminded me of a bit of a racing game, this. This is very unusual. I've never seen this before. This is different. Huh. Yeah, okay, well, I'll tell you what, let's try it out and then see what it's like. Oh, uh, La Sissi Le Robots. Maybe we can read this later. Yeah, yeah we'll read it later. And this is to do with liquor and uh, absence. Oh, we don't have time to talk about that right now. Well, okay, fair enough, we're, got, we're not going to talk about liquor and absence. What's upstairs? So yeah, I think I like this view. It's very unusual. I don't know if I like it or not, to be honest. I'm going to have to try it out a bit more and, uh, and see. I'll give it a chance. I'll give it a chance. I know some people have been doing some crazy stuff on RPG Maker. There's a person that made like a first-person shooter with RPG Maker. And it's really cool that you've done it. It really is. I forget his name now. Um, I think the game's called Fractis or something. Uh, but yes, it's, it's really cool when you see people pushing the limitations and pushing the engine of RPG Maker. It's really cool. Yes, I do like this. I was playing a game uh, recently called Chronomancer, and I think they used this technique in it as well. Not like this, but it, it was similar. They certainly have the similar views. So yeah, look at the fire. It's pretty cool, this. I think this is cool. This is definitely cool. Yeah, I like this. I'll tell you what, let's, let's try and uh, go outside and see what we've got. Sacre bleu, object received. This will come in handy. We need to check our inventory menu to have a look at it. Right, let's check out the inventory then. Okay, so this is cool, I like this. Nice little menu. So we've got objects, we've got um, quest journal, we have equipment, we have save, we have settings, we have save again, and we have keys. Cool. <laughs> let's check out the old equipment then. Okay, oh, we've got a chainsaw, I like that, oh, I like that. That's cool, that's cool, I like it now. Well, I want to get into a fight now, I want to check out the chainsaw. But like I said earlier, the, there is a, a Book of the Dead, so it does make sense to have a chainsaw, it does, it really does. Because if you're going up against the Book of the Dead, if you want a chainsaw, you genuinely do. Oh, we're going outside. Oh shit, has the game crashed? Oh, oh, fucking hell. Hello, we're we okay, we're we okay, we're we okay. I think we're just a bit of a stutter. It's very bright outside. It's a sunny, sunny day. <laughs> Let's talk to you. Who are you? Bonjour! Ah, yes, bonjour. Oui, oui, potpourri. Uh, S'il vous plaît. Uh, EVA. Um, yes, Perrier. Yeah, yeah, cool, cool. Um, Mercy, Mercy Apartments. Yes, yes, from a, from our shade. Cool, cool. Uh, so basically what he's saying there is this is my house and I can come here and rest and uh, make yourself at home, basically. Have a drink and, and relax. Okay, so this is telling me the directions. And the pub is to the south. That's what I'm reading in that sign. <laughs> okay, so, uh, yeah, this is really different, this, this camera. Oh, look at that. Well, hello. 
Does this work? I don't know. Because look at that. Because normally on games that use this, you normally have a way to change the camera angle. Look at that. That's crazy. That is crazy. Ah. No, I do like this. I do like this. Yes, I do. I do. It's different. I haven't seen it before. So yes, I do like this. Here's a village, but it's in ruins. But this is where the uh, the drunken bar fight started. So this place, this place was really, really big and had loads of buildings at one point. But after the bar fight, it all got torn down. Uh, and this is all that's left, unfortunately. That was the great bar fight of 2020. <laughs> so what have we got here then? Looks like we've got a couple of clones. Buongiorno! Oh, he's not saying much. Maybe he don't understand French. <laughs> I don't know. Bonjour, bonjour. Hugh va fatty ili. Um, okay, let's, let's let's do some fatty ili. Might have been fun. So we've got potions, and this is going to give us 30% of HP. Because HP is PV, as I'm sure you all know. And PM, of course, is magic points. <laughs> so we've got potions, we've got cookies, we've got pancakes, we've got ointments, and we've got some tonic. Cool. Um, shall we check out his arms? Yeah, so there you go. Obviously, I don't need to say all this because you guys can read this for yourself. So it's all nice to see. <laughs> uh, au revoir, au revoir. Bonjour. Oh, oh. So yes, this is a work in progress. It genuinely is. And uh, on the website, they say that they are working on an English translation. So that'd be cool. That that will be cool. Oh shit! I wasn't expecting this. Oh fucking hell! <laughs> where where we gone here? We're in the centre of the earth. I'll tell you what, can I do a save? Let's do a quick save. Oh, got all this! 24! Wow. Anyway, let's go do lucky number 7. Oh yes, oh yes. Alright, here we go then. Oh, who's this then? Oh, it's an enemy. This is our first fight. Okay, so it's side, side view. I'm not sure what I was expecting. I may be expecting front view. I don't know. So, yes, let's do a fight. I think the resolution's different, isn't it? You kind of zoom this out. Or maybe you have to do this flat effect. Like you don't have to have to... Call it Blast 7, System 7, <laughs> whatever you call it. Right, anyway, we're going to do the basic attacks and see what these look like. Because one of them's got a chainsaw, so I'm looking forward to seeing that. Okay, so basic slashy slashy. They might have poisoned me. Oh, doing some earth damage. Who are you? Bishop. Oh. Yeah, stabby stabby right in the bollocks. <laughs> oh, yes, I like this. Oh, look at that, you little fucker. Right, let's stab him again, because let's have another look. Because, to be honest with you, we are very, very different size to these people. We are, what, three, four times smaller than him. So it's a little bit off-putting, really. You could definitely make these the same as these, if that makes sense, in your um, character creation thing. I'm not sure the words for it. I don't really do side of you battles in my games, so it's um, it's a little bit alien to me, to be honest. Anyway, this guy's going to be dead with basic attacks. Uh, but I, I would genuinely say this is a little bit jarring compared to these guys here. They look very, very different. So that's something you could maybe change later. Oh, I'm liking the victory jingle. That's cool. So who have we got here exactly then? We've got Alba, we've got Lewis, we've got Vex, and we've got Darling. <laughs> And they're all about um, 39, yeah, 39 experience each, so that's pretty cool. And we've got 200 gears, nice. Alright, let's grab some gears. Um, so yes, these guys here, because you kind of got them here, although these are defaults. You can make your own in the character to creation, then you can add them into the fights. Because that would look a lot better than this, this looks a bit, it's very off-putting, it's very jarring. Right, let's check out some of the old magic spells. We'll try this one. And uh, we'll try this one. And we'll maybe try this one later. <laughs> so we've got five magic points for doing that. Whatever it was. Oh, this one's good. What's this one? What? I thought I did that to you. What the fuck are you doing? They're doing a trampoline attack. This ain't good. This ain't good. We need to get out of here. What am I doing fighting these? They're literally four times bigger than me. Let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> yeah, can we run? Oh, we can. Yeah. Retreat. Run away! Run away! Right, I'm not going to talk to you anymore. I'm, I'm getting the gist. So, yes, this is a very, very early game. To be honest, I think it's more of a, um, a concept, a proof of concept. Trying different things out, seeing what works, what doesn't. 
Um, and I'm not sure about it. I'm not sure. Does this work? Do I want? To, do I genuinely want to play a game for hours and hours like this? I don't know. I don't know. Um, some of it works, but some of it doesn't. So, for example, when I'm going down like this, it's kind of a. I don't know. I don't know. Let's play it longer. Let's find out. I haven't made my mind up yet. So it's only been ten minutes. Can you spare some coins? No, I can't. Go away. <laughs> um, because yeah, I, like I said, I, I did see this on Chronomancer, and with Chronomancer, they kind of had scenes like this here. Uh, but they wouldn't let me walk around. Yeah, it's weird. It's weird. I don't know. It's certainly taking a little while to load. That much I do know. Oh, who's this? This looks out the way for me, will you? Are you Jarvis Cocker? No, you cannot pass. Oh no! Oh hello. Uh, on mon do, on mon do, s'il vous plaît. Viva la France, like the saying Rome. <laughs> oh no, oh no. I don't think you like my translation. Mon atwa. Pity pas no pas. Oh no. Can we run away from this one? Of course we can. <laughs> oh shit! No, we can't. Fuck! Oh, 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 yeah, okay, so it's brought me back here, and I've just immediately ran into them. Let's get the fuck out of there. Oh, that's cool then, so he's disappeared. He's disappeared. Uh, maybe I do need to fight these, maybe this is the way forward. Have I got any herbs? What have I got? What have I got exactly? Uh, oh, here we go, guys. Oh, we've got nothing, we've got nothing. That's what we have, we've got a shitload of stuff here. Look here, look at all this! Jesus Christ! Uh, but we've got no items, we've got no healing potions. There's a ninja up there with a fire. That might be good. So I'll tell you what, let's kick the shit out of these then. You may not pass. What have you got to say for that? You may not pass. Oh! No. <laughs> Alright, let me beat you up then. Call me here. Uh, I'm gonna have you. Did he just call me a nerd? Fuck you! Right then, Nomu Day, Pitai Pinopus. Yes. Uh, so let's try this one. I don't think I've tried this before. I've always did. Let's do this one now. I don't want that one either. Let's do that. <laughs> and let's try Soi. I'm not sure this is the best place to do a bit of sewing, but we'll do it anyway. And this time we're going to use Hercules, because that sounds awesome, like Hercules. Let's try it. See what happens. 497, alright, so that's healed. This is Hercules. That sent me green. The Incredible Hulk. That makes sense, I like that. And uh, they seem to be shouting at me. Don't want to shout at me. <laughs> oh, we got a critical. He seems a bit hard, this one in the armor. I'm not doing much damage to him. Uh, so let's kill his little minions first. Let's kill the guys in purple. Let's take that out. Oh, he's healing himself, is it, for six? Is that what he's doing? 23 damage, that's more like it. 16, oh, that's rubbish. Oh, 333, three, three. oh, it looks good, but it's not. 41, that's more like it, that's, that's incredible Hulk. I were trying to fight them, it didn't work out. Um, okay, let's just continue trying to get this guy. So yes, what I've read online is, uh, this is a very, very short demo, it's about 30 minutes long. So don't expect too much from it. Like I said, I saw it online, it looked really different, so I thought I'd give it a go. That's what, uh, that's what I thought. Because, like I said, I haven't really played many games in this mode 7 before. Well, I'm not an RPG maker. Like I said, I have played FC and stuff like that. Um, I can't think of many other games that used it on the SNES, to be honest. What else used it? Uh, Pilot Wings? I think that might have used it. Um, What's the one with the fox? Star Fox? Did they use Mode 7? I'm not sure that they did, you know. No, I don't know. Uh, Vampire? They might have used Mode 7 for like a cutscene, possibly. It's been a long time since I played that game. Um, it's mainly F Zero that I remember using it. But I'm sure there's a big list, I'm sure there's loads out there. If you guys know any games made with F7, what's it called again? <laughs> Mode 7? Uh, let me know in the comments down below. I'd be interested to know. Mercy uh, Monu Dame. Oh, he's ran off. That's cool. That's good. Yeah, I killed the big one and they've ran off. That's cool. I like that. That's really good detail.
because that's what people do. If you take out the general, there's a high chance that the others would have run away. Yeah, that's really cool. I like that a lot. <laughs> have you got no, well, you got to save yourself now, then, lads? Yeah, I thought, I thought you might. Ten pancakes and some maple syrup. Bacon flavoured. Viva la France. Cool. Yes, Gref Death de Novice. Yeah, I'm not a novice, mate. Oh, this is normal. Okay, well, if it's normal, it's normal. And this guy's talking about a Mercedes Benz. And we've got ten omelettes and some ketchup. Oh, yes. He says it's nice to have on pizza. I'm not sure about that one, mate, but if you like on pizza, he's saying it's very natural to have it on pizza, but I, I don't believe him. I don't. I owe you let's do a save. I don't trust this guy. This guy looks a bit <laughs> I don't know, but I don't trust him. Here we go. Oh, I like that. What did that say again? Yep. Nope. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> uh, let's talk to the ninja. Maybe he's a nice ninja. Can I rest at the fire? No, because it's not demon souls. Uh, go on then. Is he nice? Is he friendly? Uh, <laughs> oh, Viant Fair Le Mange. C. C. Popa V. Oh, bollocks. <laughs> you got to be careful with this ninja. He knows some moves. He's been watching that boot out. Okay, that's no problem. I saw how it ends. I think he died. Oh, don't tell me that. No spoilers. Right, what are we going to do then? I think we're just going to do the basic attack. Let's see how much this, da uh, this does for damage. Oh, fucking hell, critical. Oh, he's a fast fucker, isn't he? he got two attacks. 64, 49, that's about 100. Uh, well, that was good. You got a critical in. So we're doing about 200, 230 damage. And, um... He's got quite a lot of hit points left. So let's do some fancy shit. Yeah. Let's do, um Let's get the Hulk out. So let's turn it green. We don't need to meditate. Oh, actually, we do. Uh, yeah, which is, yes. Oh, hang on, hang on. Um, yeah, let's do that one for that. And let's do... This one for that. And then we're going to do this for that. <laughs> I hope you're following this, guys. And then we're going to do this on him. <laughs> So this is my heal, and this is nice because you're healing me a lot, so you're not giving me like 20% hit points. You're actually giving me a lot, so I like that. Alright, I've got a guy who's turned green. And now, I'm going to be mean. Oh yes, green and mean. What a winning combination that is. We're going to fuck you up now, mate. Who is that anyway? This is Lul. Lewis. Come on, Lewis. Show him what you've got. 173, that was a nice critical, that, and that wasn't even Lewis. Oh, oh, he's bullying Lewis, he looked like Lewis. <laughs> 84, oh no, Lewis is stunned. It's always like that, isn't it? You do somebody's attack up, you buff them up, and you get stunned. I don't know, I don't know. Um, right, let's, let's check out this one. I think this is just guard, yeah, it's guard. Let's do this on Lewis, um, and let's do some Bursia D Fur. Sound of that. Oh, let me do 129, that's not bad, that's not bad. Lewis is gonna die, I'm thinking. Oh, 240 critical hit! Oh, that's a bit nasty. That was, oh, oh, we're gonna have to end this guy quick, man. We can't be messing around. I've already got uh, Ali dead, Albert, whatever she's called. I'm gonna call her Alice. She is dead. I would try to uh, revive you if I could have this, but I've got no items whatsoever. I've got loads of equipment. Oh shit, there's two of us stunned. Oh fucking hell, I'm gonna die. Fucking hell. Oh, I've got, to, I've got to concentrate here, man. I'm not dying here. Fucking hell. Um, I must have some items. Sure, there was some. Um, what are we thinking, guys? Are we gonna use the pancakes or the omelette? Oh, um, let's use the pancake on Lewis. Oh, it's all or nothing. Oh, that's not bad. Under the fort is not bad for a pancake. Oh, 182! Oh shit, 250! Oh, oh, we've got to kill him, we've got to kill him. No more pancakes. Um, oh, bollocks, I'm going to die. Uh, um, oh, oh no, oh no, what's this do again? Yeah, do it, do it, do it. Oh, that's good, he's not fighting Lewis, that's good. Lewis, dodge it, dodge it! Oh no, Lewis is dead, oh no! Right, it's all on you now, Vex. It's all on you, baby. All or nothing. Come on now, we can have it. <laughs> We're not going to win this. <laughs> 207. 
Ooh, nearly got it. I have, I have. Let's let's do a healing. Oh, I misclicked. That's not a heal. Of course, this is a heal. Oh, it is. I'm sorry. <laughs> you would think I don't understand it, but you wouldn't you? 207. I'm dead meat. I'm dead meat. I'm not sure how I can revive these guys. Let's use uh, an omelette and get Lewis back. Because I like Lewis. Lewis will uh, No, 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 Vex is dead. Vex is dead. Mercy Buku. Oh no. <laughs> Alright, let's try this again. Let's try this again. Hang on, she changed her hair. Oh, it's the game over. Oh yeah. So this is nice. This is blue. And she's now blonde. She's bleached her hair. <laughs> it suits you, love. It suits you. Oh dear. Alright, let's try that again. Let's try that again. Lucky seven. I don't know if it's lucky. I don't know if it's lucky. <laughs> uh, I tell you what, let's go out of here. Let's go outside. Let's see if there's anything else to explore. Uh, because I'm not sure what that is. I'm not sure what that will unlock. So let's see if there's any cities or any towns or something. Because that'd be cool to explore. Because like I said, I haven't really seen this before. So I am interested to see what you can, uh, what you can actually do with this. I am very curious. So yeah, let's see if there's a town. Let's see if there's a pub. That's what I want. I want a drink. Because <laughs> to be honest, I didn't even know I was going to go down there. I just fell down it. Uh, what's in here again? This is a weapon shop, isn't it? I believe. Yeah, yeah. Fine, 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 fine. It's having a good old think, isn't it, with the loading? Perhaps if I get rid of the shadows and the rendering, it might change. It might be a lot easier to load. Uh, but it has got a lot to load, and it has. Oh, treasure chest. Uh, hello, what's this? We found three cookies! Oh yes! Trippy, huh? <laughs> oh, oh, what else we got here then? So this water's looking a bit poisonous, so I don't want to go swimming in there. Oh, we've got another chest. What have we got here then? Three pancakes! Oh, nom nom nom! I like pancakes. I think this is going back home actually, isn't it? Yeah, this is, this is back home. So uh, maybe this is all there is, to be honest. Like I said, it's a very, very um, early access game. Beta, Delta, fucking Zulu, I don't know. It's an early access, it's not early access, it's an early proof of concept. That's what this is. It's uh, seeing if things work. And to be honest, I think this does work. I don't mind this too much. Going up, it certainly works. Going down, it does look a bit, oh shit, it does look a bit strange. But no, I do not mind this whatsoever. So yes, I think you could definitely, definitely make an RPG game out of this. Zibu play. It is locked. Nice. Um, well, let's, let's fight the ginger. Let's see what he's like. Oh, he's got a big fucking mace. Fucking hell. A double handed mace. I've never seen such a thing. But why not? Why not? Um, oh, oh, there's more. I thought this were a dead end, but it's not. It's not. Oh, no. What's this? I'm liking the music. I do like any music. Village Socrates, all aboard. Ooh, that sounds interesting. Oh, so we've got a village. This is cool. This is what I want to see, actually. Yeah, I want to explore the village. This is cool. Uh, this is a statue of uh, Napoleon. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. I like that going inside and outside the shop. That was pretty cool, that. I like that. Let's check that out again. <laughs> if I knew it was going to take this long, I would have fucking checked it out again. So, yeah, yeah this is really cool. Let's check this out. Yeah, yeah that's nice. Alright then, who are you? Salute! Salute to you, my friend! Bonjour! Let's have a fight! My mercy! Um, so again, it's another weapon shop. I've got 325 coins, not coins, what do you call them? Franks, not francs, what do you call them? Cogs! I've got 35, 325 cogs, and potions and pancakes cost... How much do they cost? Three? How much are they? Oh, God! Oh, fucking hell, they're expensive. It's so level 100. 100 cogs each. So I don't, I don't think I need any right now. So I'll maybe come back later. Because I am very geared up. You gave me a lot of stuff here. Which I like, don't get me wrong. I'm not complaining. <laughs> I'm not. Yeah, check out all this. Check out all this stuff. Anyway, it's somewhere on the, the menu screen. If you guys are interested in this game, the link will be down below. I, um. I do suggest giving it a go, because, you know, 
you ever played an RPG Maker game in this mode before? I haven't. Maybe you have. Maybe this isn't new to you, but it is to me. And it is quite strange. Can I pass, please, Monsieur? Single play, please? Oh, these are going to be evil. Uh, the captain is out at the moment. He's in the next village. Okay. I used to be an adventurer like you. Oh, did you really? What's this then? We've got a magic shop. Let's check out the spells. This is what I want to spend money on. I don't want to spend it on potions. Oh, there's no one here. Hello? Anyone here? <laughs> oh, that's nice. This is restored my hit points, I believe. I'll do a little save here. Save gender, save gardener. Yeah, we'll do some of that. <laughs> yep. <laughs> All right. Let's see what else is in this uh, in this town. It's taking a while to load, isn't it? Well, oh, oh, let's look in here. Let's look in here. Oh no, it's locked. Can't go in. Oh, the curtains are locking me out. <laughs> uh, I think we've been in here, haven't we? So they are very similar inside. I don't mind. Oh no, we haven't been in here. Hey, how are you doing? Salute. Oh, I have been here. Yes, it's very interesting. Yes, yes. So I don't know how much more work you're going to do on this game. I don't know how much work it is to actually do this in a game. I really haven't got a clue. Uh, yes, I, I genuinely don't know how you do this. I've never looked into it. So if this is quite relatively easy-ish to do, I would definitely suggest uh, continuing with it. I would. But if this is like really, really difficult. Um, I don't know, you might want to find a different engine. Some, pe oh, well, some people might suggest. Um, but no, I personally think this does work with RPG Maker. Like I said, going down does look a bit weird. I would like to see more screen going down. But yes, yes, it definitely works. Yes. Right then, let's fight this ninja and let's see if something else happens. Because I am a bit curious. I'm thinking it might just be game over at that point. Uh, but we will find out, we'll carry on exploring. See what else there might be. There might be a lot more. Right, so I've been there, I've been on the other screen. I've been west, I've been east. I can't go south because there's like a poisonous... Uh, <laughs> there's a poisonous sea. I'm certainly not stepping into that. So, let's fight the ninja. Oh, fuck, where's he gone? Oh, he's down the hole. Yes, let's go down the hole and fight a ninja. Here we go. Right. Oh no, not this again. Earth out of the mold, as the French would say. <laughs> so yes, in case you don't know, oh bollocks, Yorkshire Pud is not very good at French. Um, I'm sure you've worked that out now. <laughs> I wish I was, uh, but no. I, I, I struggled learning English, to be honest. So no, I don't know about French at all. Oh, golden statue. So this gives me hit points back like that. And I like the sound effects as well. That's pretty cool. Alright, let's find this ninja. Because, I mean, at the end of the day, we've got this new RPG Maker coming out now, haven't we? That uh, RPG Maker MZ, I think it's called. So you've also got to think, do you want to spend your time doing this? Or do you want to get MZ and perhaps start again? You know, uh, I think a lot of people are asking themselves that. And I think a lot of people are not going to bother upgrading what I've heard. But, um, yeah, I don't know. We'll see. I, I think a lot of people are going to get MZ. Because it's the latest one, isn't it? You know? Right, we definitely need some strategy here. And I fucking wish to God I could understand this shit. <laughs> so this one here, I'm thinking, is definitely increasing the attack. This is increasing my, my PT, my PM, and my PV. So this is my heal. This is definitely heal. I think that's heal all. And so in, this is regenerate one power. So there you go. Maybe I can read more than I uh, I've realised. <laughs> Um, this is trampoline. I'm thinking this reduces the enemy's agility by 90%. It sounds a bit good, that 90%. But, you know. uh, and this reduces their defense. So yeah, let's go around a buffing and um, nuking, not nuking, nerfing. <laughs> and let's beat him up, fucking ninja. Come on, guys, there's only one of it. We should be able to fucking bash him. 
So under 19, oh yeah, we're doing much better now. Oh yes, we are. Oh yeah, we're going to have him now. We've got him by the short and curvies. <laughs> Uh, in fact, let's do the same thing that we did. No, let's not. Let's attack. Yes. Yeah, attack, attack, attack. That's how you win. 98. Not bad. We're doing a lot more. A lot more damage. He's only criti critical damage in us. 25. You're doing a lot more previous. So, yes, us debuffing him with that defense spell. That is definitely the way to go. You definitely want to use that, guys. This guy, he's dead meat. Great. Oh, that sounds cool. 83. 2020, 20, 20. <laughs> Hey, he can't stand much more of this. He cannot. We're just going to attack. I'm not sure what anything else does. <laughs> oh, that was a good one. Critical for 241. That was good. One more round and he's dead. Oh, maybe he's dead now. Two, two, two. Oh, here we go, here we go. Oh, yes. There we go. What's he saying then? We've got some victory music, and we've got some herbs and some pancakes. That'll be nice. We can make an omelette. And we've leveled up. Level two. All right. I'm liking this. Some nice big numbers there. I'm liking that. Cool, cool, cool. And Lewis has leveled up. And Vix has leveled up. And so has Darley. <laughs> and we've got a potion, a crocodile's tooth, and a pancake. And 1,250 French cocks. Cool. I'm liking the music, by the way. This is nice. This is really nice music. Yeah, this is nice. The last chef, the bandit, was victorious. Thank you for playing my game. Uh, this was a quick demo. Uh, thank you very much, Yorkshire Pud. <laughs> I think that's what it said. Uh, no, it said actually to check my quest journal. So let's check that out. No, um, bear with me. No, that's safe. Of course that's safe. Of course, of course. This one here. Oh no, no. Where's the quest journal? Oh, I don't fucking know. <laughs> uh, it wouldn't do me much good even if I could find it, to be honest. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, but definitely kill the ninja. That's cool, that's cool. He's definitely dead. These guys are just staying here forever. Yes, they are. Bonjour. Salut, madame. Uh, salute to you as well. So that's what I want to do. I want to find a pub. Let's find a pub and get some absence. I think they still sell that in France, don't they? The absence. They pop the good stuff as well, not the. Because um, they sell like different versions of absence. They sell one that's like really, really rubbish. Um, and then you've got like your proper, proper absence. That's what I want. I want your proper stuff. Where is it? <laughs> I want to uh, put it on a sugar cube and do all that nonsense. It looks cool. Give me some absence. I like this because it is actually green. So I do like that your potion's green. <laughs> so I want some of that and I want some sugar cubes. Where's your sugar? Is this it? Cookie? Cookie sugar? Yeah. Alright, let's get first. Let's hallucinate. <laughs> to be fair, I've never actually done absence, so I don't know how hallucinogenic it is. I suspect it's probably not that hallucinogenic. Uh, but I don't know. I really don't know. Again, if you tripped your balls off an absence, let me know. Let me know in the comment section. But I, I would think it would be like a very mild hallucinogen. Uh, you know, hearing faint noises, maybe seeing things in peripheral vision. You know, very, very mild. That's what I think. Uh, right then, guys, I think this is everything here. I don't think there's meant much more to explore. In fact, I will talk to these bozos in this, um, that was blocking the cave, because maybe they'll let me in now. I don't know. Kill the head ninja. So, yeah, they, they might let me inside now. Um, it's a bit weird, it kind of feels like I could fall off here, but I can't, so that's cool. Uh, it kind of reminds me a bit of like Toe Jam and Earl on the Mega Drive. <laughs> you could fall to different levels, and you could go to level zero. And there were these babes in the hot tub, and get inside and have a drink. <laughs> Toe Jam and Earl, that's a good game, I like that game. Uh, I think they did a remake of it recently, actually. Um, I haven't played it. It's on the Switch, I've been told. Right then, guys, are you going to let me in now? Civil play? Mono May? Popo? Fucking what? Last Torres? Oh, oh, the music stopped. We're getting serious now, guys. Something's, something's happening here. We have no music. And he's got sunglasses on. He's looking pretty cool, dude. He's looking cool. Avacaplaster? 
I don't have any plasters. Oh, this, 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 what's this? Crevos Tors. Oh, what's that mean? I think it means, fuck you. <laughs> fuck you and fuck your ancestors. That's what it means. <laughs> okay, so I'm healed up, that's good. I've got full hit points. So, uh, yeah, let's do, um, let's do the basic attack first. And let's just see how much armor I've got. So I might need to uh, nerf them all again. I might need to use all that to uh, magic. Oh shit, they're fucking hard, aren't they? Bloody hell, mate. Oh no, Lewis is fucking dead. Yeah, I'm gonna have to use all these buffing skills again, aren't I? Um, what have we got then? What have we got? Um, yeah, let's do that one. Oh, I've got new, I've got new, new spell. I've got pointy ardente. Oh, that sounds good. Oh, that sounds good. That. Is this new? Torres de Lamas. Oh, let's try some of that as well. Okay, so I've seen this one before, this is my basic armor. So I've gone green, got angry like a hulk. Bruce Banner, Bruce Wayne, Bruce something, Bruce Campbell. <laughs> How much damage are you doing now to me? 97, that's not bad, that's not bad. Um, but you're definitely kicking my ass. I'm, I'm seeing a theme, I'm getting my ass kicked a lot in this game. <laughs> but I've set the bitch on fire, that's good. She's burning, burning. Oh no, he's stunned. I'm not liking this stun thing. Because I'm only fighting the two characters now. This sucks. I do not like being stunned. I don't think anyone does in general. But I have. Early on in the game, I do not like it. Oh, 10 damage. I can take that. That's nothing. That's nothing. I can take that. 512? Bloody hell. I cannot take that. Come on, kill the fucker. Come on, oh, come on. One hit point. You've got one hit point left. You've got it. Fucking kill me. Fine. Let's do some fucking shit then. Um. I'll um. Just fucking hit her. And I need. I need meditation. We fucking do as well. Here we go. Here we go. Four hit points. That'll do. That'll do. <laughs> Fifty-one damage. That's all right. That's better. But I reckon this bitch is going to win the real hard and shit. Oh, 133. I fucking knew it. Right, you're dead. Next. Drop some, drop some, drop some crystals or something. That's interesting. Uh, oh no, I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. Um, what's this one again? Yes. Um, yes. Yes. Let's do that on her. I am having to think a lot on this game. <laughs> oh, zero. I like zero. That's awesome. I like seeing zero. Ninety-seven. I can take that. I can take that. Let's kill this one real quick. 102, that's nice. Let's just do exactly the same thing. I think I've got Commander Member on. So another round of the exact same thing. Oh no, I'm no longer green. That's not good, that's not good. And uh, the darling's dead. Oh no, darling. Darling, darling, darling. Um, has she got a heal? Yes, pancakes. Uh, oh, I don't need pancakes right now. No, we don't. We don't. So let's increase my defense again. And you can... Uh, does she need to meditate? I don't think she does. No. No. Uh, yes, we'll do this one. So I don't want to miss. I definitely want to kill her this round. Uh, right, we're green and we're mean. Can't wait till it's my fucking turn. Go on, hit him. There we go. 197. Overkill, but I don't mind it. And now it's just you and me. Two on one. I'm liking this. I'm liking these odds. I'm going to kill you. Um, yes, let's do that in fact. It's a good idea. Don't you? <laughs> Alright, we've got a shield, we've got our attack up. I'm now going to nerf her because she's hurt, she's cheap. She kicks her hard. Where's the. Um... Is it that one? No, it's not that one. Is it that one? No, it's not that one. I think actually she's on attack of duty. It's her, it? Yes, yeah, this one. Here we go. It's Bex. She's got the debuffs. Alright, 230, and I believe she's got minus 5, this means 5 turns, she's got um, something, <laughs> she's got less armour for 5 turns, I think that's what it means. Right, basic attack, because I'm pretty sure she's got to be weak now. Yes, look at that, oh that was shit, I thought that said 100, I thought that said 112, that was shit. 12, 12, 12 is blank, blank, blank. Um, provocation, no, 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 no. Uh, yeah, I just want to fucking kill her, come on. Yeah, 
yeah, let's burn her. This will do it. This is a good one, this. Yeah, look at that. Nearly 200. And 187. She's dropped an emerald. Nice. We've got a crystal. We've got a gamer boner. And we've got an emerald purr. <laughs> cool. And he is now speechless. Non vu discreet Japan. Allo chez moi. Hmm, interesting. Okay, let's let's do a save. Why not? Why not indeed? Oh. Donk vos save uko buku asu a affirmative na esto si pap. Oh, lamo free la muego los culturist destroyed la church. Bien, bien, Jarvis Cocker entitled Diaquil, Arvis Infantiament, SD Survival Island on Montago. Huh, that is interesting. Oh, oh, I. Tell me more, my friend, tell me more. Sacre la Vange on History, Porphyry Court, La Vantus. Copperland, the cultist, who independent, Fortitude. La Amandus Lopus. Right. So there you go, guys. Basically, what they're saying there, as I'm sure you all know, um, somebody has stolen the Book of the Dead, and it's our responsibility to get it back. And we might have to maybe reunite the kingdoms to fight the Army of Darkness, because there's so many of them. Um, it's very doubtful we can actually defeat the Army of Darkness by ourselves. So yes, we need to find um, neighbouring kingdoms, we need to broker peace treaties, and all that kind of good stuff. That's what we need to do. Hello, who are you? <laughs> they look very unusual. So we've got like two um, gargoyle type of people? I don't know. <laughs> anyway guys, I'll tell you what, I think I'm going to leave it here. Uh, I'm a bit Frenched out right now. I don't think I can translate any more for you. <laughs> Although I am curious. What's in here? What's in here? Go on then, go on then. Are you going to let me in? Oh, you fat. You're not letting me in. Oh, that's a shame. But like the French used to say, a case of savoir, savoir. <laughs> anyway, guys, if you want to try this game out, you can. Link in the description down below. I genuinely found this interesting. I do. This I haven't seen before. It's very new to me. It's very different. And, um... Yes, why not? I don't know if you're going to stick with it, I really don't. I don't know how time consuming this is. I, mean, I am not a clue. I really don't. Um, but if you want to make a game like this, if your dream RPG maker is in this mode 7, Flash 7, what's it called? Fucking Blast Plan, whatever the fuck it's called. <laughs> if you want to make a game in this style, you do it, mate. You crack on. Um, it's not going to be for everyone. Some people are going to nitpick at it. Stuff like this, they're not going to like. Um, but you know what? I don't mind it. I really don't mind it too much at all. Anyway, guys, that's definitely enough for me for the one day. And I'll see you all next time. Au revoir.